So in this video, we are going to see that how can we log in into Upstock's account if we don't remember our login details. So if you have forgotten the details, this video is definitely for you. Before that, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Let's start the video. Now to log in into your Upstock's account, you need to open Upstock's application first. And this is the uh, main login page at the start. You can see sign up or login. You have to enter your registered mobile number first in order to, uh, you know, go to the next step. So after entering your registered mobile number, all you have to do is you have to select continue option and you will receive an OTP which you have to enter and go to the next page. So in my phone, uh, you know, uh, auto detect option is on. So you can see uh, once I receive OTP, it will automatically detect it and it will take me to the next page. Now after entering the OTP and going to the next page, it will ask you to enter six digit pin to complete your login process. But as I told you, if you don't remember your login details, like if you don't remember your pin, then how can you, you know, reset that? So once you are on this particular page, you have forgot pin option over here at the top, select that particular option. And on the next page, you have to enter your pan details. After entering details, select continue. So I've entered the pan details. Let's select continue option. Now you will receive a six digit OTP on your mobile number and uh, email ID. So whichever is, uh, you know, comfortable for you, you can go and check out your OTP and you have to enter the OTP over here and then again, select the continue option. So I have entered the OTP, let's select continue option. And now you can see it has taken us to the next page over here. You have to enter new pin so you can create new pin and then select continue option. So after entering new pin, select continue option, but make sure that your new pin should not match your previous pin. If uh, it does, then it won't accept it. So you have to change or you can, again, if you remember your pin, then you can uh, basically log in into your account. Select continue option over here and again, enter the pin to confirm your details. So after re-entering the new pin, once again, select continue option and then it will take us to the login page. This time you can enter your mobile number once you enter the mobile number, uh, again, select continue option. And now you have to enter the OTP. And after that, the new pin, which you have created, you have to enter it over here. So after entering the new pin, you can see uh, it is giving us some option. Like you can set up your fingerprint. You can, I'm, you know, I'm skipping it for now. Biometric skip and just select done option. And now you can see we have successfully logged into our Upstocks account. So this is how simple it is uh, to, you know, reset your pin if you don't remember in Upstocks. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. If you find this video informative, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you.